In this video, I'm going to be giving you a tour of my £5,000 gaming setup. But first, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Plixie, I'm a FIFA content creator and streamer. And I'm going to be putting out insane content like this video. So if you want to be part of that and you want to be notified with my videos, make sure to subscribe and turn post notifications on. But before I get into it, I just want to say that I've earned all of this setup and I'm so grateful. Now enough of the waffle, let's get to the setup. So here is the background of my room. And I'm going to be showing you in-depth detail of all of my products. So here is what the setup looks like from my point of view. Starting with the first monitor, we have an Ayama 165Hz curved monitor. And with the same one with the second. Moving on to the things with the desk, I have a SteelSeries Apex Pro keyboard and a wireless G Pro Superlight. Here at the back, we have my Stream Deck and my mouse bungee for whenever my mouse needs to charge. Moving up from the setup, I have one Elgato key light there and another one there. The reason I have two is to cancel out the shadows. Underneath my desk right here, I have my PS5 controller with some random thumb grips on. I don't know what they are. And here to the left of the setup, we have my display. I have a lot of boxes that I've collected throughout my time of having a gaming setup. And here I'm going to be giving you an in-depth detail of each of my products that I've bought. So starting at the bottom, we have two Elgato face cams. Um, this one here, I actually broke that one. So I had to get a new one. So the reason why I've got two is because of that. Here I've got my Galaxy Light projector. I might introduce it to my setup soon, but I'm not too sure. Here I have one Nano Leaf box and then I hit another one right there, as you can see. Um, there. That is for my Nano Leaf that is behind me. I'm going to be giving you a tour of that in a minute. And we have got one of the Elgato key lights there and another one of the Elgato key lights right there. And then we have my HyperX Quadcast S. My PS5 controller, my DT990 Pros, my Logitech G Pro Wireless, and then up there we have my Apex Pro, my mouse mat, my iPhone 7 case, a headphone hanger, a mouse bungee, a Red Dragon keyboard, a Ducky 1 Too Mini. Here, starting behind the display, is my LED strips that go all the way around my room. Very nice detail and adds to the scenery a bit. And none of these LED lights would be effective if I did not have these blackout curtains. Now, the reason I have these is because that stops light from getting through and then I can control my light and have good light management. One missing detail I did, I have this gooseneck holder here that hangs my phone for whenever I want to go live on TikTok or Instagram or just go live on something on my phone. Just underneath the gooseneck, we actually have my PC right there. No RGBs in it because at the time I bought my PC, I didn't really know what I should get. So I had to settle with this. It's got a 2060 and i7 processor and it is all around a very, very good PC. Now we're moving around to what you guys see. So here is what you guys see. Here's my HyperX Quadcast S. I customized it in the blue colour because personally I think that goes better with my theme. Here is my logo. Um, it's very, very good. It goes very well with my background. You can customise it different colours. As you can see, it comes with a little remote control. And just like that, you can just change the colours. Yeah, very, very useful. Moving on to the insane Nano Leaf. I absolutely love this. Best introduction into my setup recently and probably my best introduction throughout my whole setup ever. Um, yeah, it, it just looks sick. You cannot deny it. Insane background, good lighting. It's so, it's just incredible, really. But now if I stand up, here's my X Rocket gaming chair. Had it for around two years now. Haven't really had any issues with it, but I'm looking to upgrade soon. And here are the DT990 Pros. They are very, very nice, as you can see. Very nice feel on the inside. There, that's what it looks like on the inside. Yeah, it, it's just, it's sublime. The things you can do with this headset, uh, the sound quality, the comfort, it's just amazing. And there is one thing outside my room that I quickly want to show you right here. As you can see, I have a little thing that says, I'm streaming, please do not enter, thank you. So none of the family members or anybody that I live with or anyone that comes to my house walks in whenever I'm live or recording. And that is just about my gaming setup. And don't forget to see the description for a link of all my products. And as ever, make sure you smash that subscribe button, turn on post notifications so you don't miss any content. And I'll see you guys soon.